Hey, 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 everybody, what's happening? Welcome to my channel, T Girl Magic Tarot. Yeah, yeah. I'm here to do a reading from my Gemini Collective. I'm doing a reading for Gemini couples. Yep, I gotta get it right because I had it written down because like, it's in order. Yeah, Gemini couples, welcome, welcome, welcome. All zodiac signs are welcome. Anybody's welcome. You guys, this is about the Gemini couples, people dealing with, or you're dealing with a Gemini. Okay, you're a couple and your husband or your spouse is a Gemini. Okay, um, keep in mind that the message is a general collective reading. It is not a personal reading. Take the energies that resonate and leave the rest. Never force anything to fit ever, 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 ever. And I want to thank everybody for all your love and support that you do. So, yeah, let's get into a choir real quick because the only Gemini's, you know, we got to get our song in, couples. Come on, boo boos. <coughs> One, two, three, oh, T Girl, Tarot, Magic and Collective. T Girl, T Girl, T Girl, Magic and Collective. T Girl, Tarot, Magic and Collective. Check us out and see what we're about. Ooh. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. We sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. We are Gemini, 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 all right, now let's see what's get into it. Holy Spirit. I did shuffle these, though, too, except for this one. I'm going to shuffle this one. The Holy Spirit. Ooh, Gemini, I know y'all ain't going through a tower of ending. Is this the Gemini couples? Gemini, are you ending it with somebody? Are you walking away? Yeah, you left somebody. Oh, snap. Gemini, you found out somebody. Ooh, I don't know. What the hell? Gemini couple, what is happening? Okay, now this is definitely, I hope it's not. Somebody leaving somebody and want to end somebody. Yeah, because somebody feels like somebody's a liar. Somebody had a baby that wasn't theirs. Ooh, child, somebody want to leave somebody and go to their two of cups. Child, a Libra, justice, they want to balance out their life. And that's bringing the tower to whoever this baby mama, queen of pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo is. Child, oh my God, did they find out? For some of y'all, somebody found out that their spouse had an abortion. Oh my God. What? And that's why they ended the cycle with they behind. Oh wow, they went spying or looking, and they found out that that's what had 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 happened. Mm, mm, mm. Gemini, this is heavy already. We ain't even got into all of that. So now somebody want to fight a Aries energy. So somebody found. Oh my god, this is too much. Somebody found out they spouse. I don't know what's going on. There's a Virgo involved, the air sign involved. Something got exposed about a two of cups energy, a child, and mm, that somebody was married and somebody wants justice now because a king of pentacles or a queen of pentacles accepted the offer from a king of wands and left. Got that dick and left. Oh, damn, that was a one night stand. Yeah, yeah, somebody is upset. They, the hoodie, they, ooh, they sat in their head, honey. So, what is this? Is this, is this what, are you? Spirit, are they together? Because this sounds like something. Spirit, what happened? I'm almost. Are they together? Are these... Is this a couple? Spirit said yes. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> this is a couple, Spirit, for real? Spirit said yes. Yeah, a couple in bad. Is that, honey, they. <sighs> I don't even know what to say. They're at the Nine of Wands right now. Somebody feels. They feel victimized or is this a couple? Yeah, they, they, oh, somebody, okay, so this is one of those. So I'm going to just keep it 100 couples. Now, if you happy a couple, this is not for you, baby, okay? If you happy and you doing good and stuff, this is definitely not for you. This is a karmic um couple. No, I'm no offense. Don't, please don't get offended when I say a karmic couple, but somebody in, somebody's in their head because they married somebody. Somebody's in a marriage that with a Jezebel-like or a hoe or a male or female, they they sat and they in their mind because they invested in the wrong person. Yeah, they thought it was their ten, they thought it was their nine of cups, but this person wants to block out in something with a liar. 
They want to come to whoever their nine of cups is all traumatized and wounded, worried and stuff. And talk about I want a commitment and I want to do the right thing and I made the judgment call to be with you. That sounds so weird. Does it work like that though? So did somebody leave you in your marriage, honey? And then they went over to see that the grass wasn't greener or they got with a Jezebel or a Jezebel pop. Look, okay, if your spouse left you, whoever you are, high vibe, you're the, you're this. You're very upright. You're very protected by Archangel Michael. Now, just because you're protected by Archangel Michael, don't be no damn fool and run back into the damn fire pit. Because whoever this liar is, they are bisexual, number one. They got with somebody who was wild like them, low-key, bisexual, possibly got them sick, and they left this person because of that. They're coming back to you, but you done ended the cycle. I think you see something. You know something. Whoever you are, baby, you see, you know, okay? You see, you looking, okay? Somebody's trying to figure out why you closed the cycle with them. They hope you don't know that they're sick or lying because they, look, look, because whatever they left in and snuck in and invested in, that brought them, they still at the same position that they were in. Now they were looking for an equal give and take wherever they left you at because they thought that was their wish fulfillment. They possibly even married them or got into a higher level of commitment and got under judgment literally right after that. And some of them started doing magic. What the fuck is this? Is this a couple though, spirit? For people in couples. Um, this could be your person doing stuff against you because you possibly walked away and ended it. So... But I want a happy couple, Spirit. I don't understand. Spirit say no. <laughs> oh, my God. There is happy couples. Yes, there is happy couples. Okay, some of y'all, the happy couple, because I'm like, because mm -mm, everybody need to, they need to get fed. Okay, so you know what I'm saying. And this is a karmic energy who wants. So if you're already in another relationship and you're happily married, because it looks like you are happily married, whoever the high vibing angel is. So you have somebody in your past, from your past, possibly a fire sign who's a liar, who you ended a cycle with. They still ain't let you go, boo. Even you married and everything. You got a whole nother family, a whole nother life. And they sad because they did not invest in you. Are they sad that they want to invest in you? I don't know. You already happily married. What's going on, spirit? Or what do they do? Or maybe, maybe, oh, oh, I'm getting another download. Lord, have mercy, help me. Mm, mm, mm. Your, your spouse might be acting. Okay, your current spouse, who you with now, happily married. And I didn't mean that in a mean way. Because they're under some type of judgment for lying or sneaking. Because I got to keep it 100 with you. Maybe you know, maybe you don't. But I feel like you don't. They're in their head about what you don't know when they leave at night or go invest in or... They go to a, some of them are a, are a part of a club or something, but that club is a coven. Oh, Lord have mercy. And they be doing things in that club with each other, child, okay? And you look at this person as your everything, though, but you don't know what they be doing in secret. And some of y'all done ended it with a, I heard a warlock. So your spouse could be a warlock. Not all of y'all spouses now, don't be trying to go home and, you know... Um, you some this person, whoever some of y'all is with a warlock, yep, 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 and they under some type of judgment, honey, for doing stuff in the dark and nasty things behind your back with other menses, with other cult leaders. Lord have mercy, this is horrible. Spirit, why does the couples need to know this? I know this is not my high vibrational angel's uh spouse hell. Oh, damn, what is this? Maybe. Sp Spirit said, I came to bring the pain. Dang, that's what I heard. He said, I came to bring the pain. Cypress Hill. I don't know what that means. I know Cypress Hill, the, the rap group back in the day. But I don't know. Somebody came to bring the pain. Spirit needs to expose. Yeah, because you're somebody's in an illusion. They feel like they're in an equal give and take or something like that. But it's not. Their husband is not being, or their wife. Is not being upfront and forward with what they do with their sexual curricular activities in the dark. With, oh, child, I cannot with other people. Okay? Spirit needs to bring it out. You know, I'm serious. This is the age of Aquarius was done in the dark. It's, bum, 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 bum. it's exposed. And if this is not happening now, it will be in the, look, past, present, or future. 
somebody stressed out about what they be doing in secret or when they do at night or when they do, yeah, or is going to find out what you, you're going to find out what they've been doing and you're going to block them. Yeah, so that's somebody for somebody in a relationship. Lord have mercy. Yeah, then you're gonna be they're gonna be heartbroken or they're looking to see do you know anything? They they kind of suspect something because somebody's been holding back from sex and from the relationship a little bit. Yeah, somebody's been acting single and stuff like that because they really want to walk away and take a leap of faith and be a yellower. You know what I mean? Yeah, they want to be single. That I want to be single. And they've made some type of decision and they're still trying to figure it out what they want to do. Somebody's rushing. What are they rushing into, spirit? Somebody wants to rush towards you. So the married person want to rush towards you? This high priestess, this high priestess is married. And they want to rush towards you in a marriage because you're this person's wish fulfillment in this. Okay, so there's a male warlock, cult, coven, whatever the case may be. Somebody in love with you that is in that type of realm or whatever the case may be. Uh, activities, curricular, whatever. They want to come travel to you. Okay, what do they want to come travel to you for? Because they see you as wish fulfillment. But they, they, child, they're not telling you that either they... If you get with this person, this is like the poisonous apple. But this one, it, it, instead of putting you into sleep, it'll put you into sleep for eternity. And this person is stressed out. They want you to make the effort. They're trying to figure out how they're going to get you to invest in them because they really don't have nothing to offer you. And they want to equal give and take, but they can't give it to you. And they are in their head about it. So I don't know. So if you're a married couple, why would this person? So you got somebody in their head, baby. About what they do in extra career. I don't know why spirit, because spirit wants them to know. Okay, so I got to be obedient. I don't want to give these crazy messages anytime. But somebody is coming, going back and forth, doing whatever they do with somebody else, and then come and making love offers to you. That's how diseases spread, okay? And that's the truth, because you're in some type of illusion, and God don't want nobody in no illusion. And then they get mad when the truth is brought. And then they want to keep moving forward in the same energy in these lies. And then that's when the wheel turns upside down and somebody ends up like, so I'm just saying, God is trying to wake somebody up. I don't know who this is, but wake up, baby. Put something down to rest because you're going to have bad luck. I know somebody's in a marriage, or but this marriage is a sham or an illusion or something. This is not for the happy couples. This is not, but some of this couple pretend to be happy, though. Because they allow this open fluid, uh, look, I'm not, look, do what thou wilt. That sounds crazy, though. That's between you and God at this point. But there's too much going on with deception and open. You need, somebody needs some type of structure. The king of swords, somebody needs some structure and discipline. Yeah, they need to move away from that type of lifestyle and behavior. Somebody is, yeah. A Gemini, you, this, this is you. You coming out heavy. So this is a, a Gemini... Uh, uh, yep. He come in or she come in to work on things with you. Okay? Queen of Cups. Oh, Lord have mercy. But this person, like I said, I don't know. Spirit, what do you say? Spirit say, this person, if you want to be like this, keep the person or something like that. Because this is, or this person could be, I'm just getting, this is, there's somebody lying in your relationship. You're happy with them though. You're really happy with them. Could be some ups and downs and imbalances, but right now, right now, they are imbalanced. They're wish-washy. Sometimes they're hot and cold. They love you, then they don't. You know what I mean? So, but you kind of feel like this person is being manipulative with you, okay? And then they are petty as well, but it's all an illusion because they are showing up as the king of swords in reverse now. Why are they showing up as the king of swords in reverse? Because they're lying, they're lying if they say that they're happy or they want to work out with, on it with you. They don't. And I'm not trying to hurt your feelings. I'm sorry, sweetheart. But whoever this is, they're being manipulative. They're doing some type of... Yeah. And they're in regret of what, spirit? They're in regret of... I don't know what they're in regret of, baby. I'll, I'll figure it out. Hold on. Let me get... Because their cards are all turning like this and flipping. Hold on. Let me shuffle and then let me... Uh, but yeah, somebody is in balance and they're in regret for something. Maybe some magic that they did or some dishonesty, toxicity, some 
they did something, okay? You have a spouse that's doing, did something that they're ashamed of, king of swords, with some of active sexual nature. I'm going to put it that way, okay? Mm. And that's the truth, because that one didn't come out after I said that. This king of cups and the king of pentacles. They was to, I'm telling you, I don't know if you know an earth sign, water sign. These people are their friends. I don't know who they are. But this person's all in their head because they are commingling with an earth sign somehow. This earth sign is investing in, Todd, I'm telling you, I don't know how this is going, but wake up, wake up, wake up. Okay? So, Spirit, what else do you want the babies, the married people, the, whoever this is for? Because this is, like I said, not for everybody. What do you want them to know, Holy Spirit? What do you want them to know? Somebody is, if you're pregnant... Oh my God, what's going on? Something about a pregnancy now. Something about a child and a pregnancy. So you could be pregnant. And because you're, I can't make it up. Because you're pregnant, you just may not leave your husband or this person. Yeah, you guys are going to reconcile. And that's fine. Yeah, that's, okay, yeah. But there's something that you don't see. What do they don't see though, spirit? Because you want to reconcile or you're going to stay with this person or you love this person and that's your husband. I'm not never saying not love your husband. You love your husband, but the husband is doing some crazy stuff or the wife. Okay? What else, spirit? Somebody's going to move forward anyway. I don't know. Because of a betrayal? Oh, so if you're pregnant and you find out about this situation, of course you're going to feel betrayed and heavy burdened and you're going to reject the offer. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles, that's what you're going to do. Because you're, mm, poor baby, I'm sorry. Yeah, because something was revealed or this was revealed or you got an intuition about it and you already knew you was going to have to move forward because you was being manipulated in some form or fashion. This is like a movie almost. I'm like, dang. But this is real life and real life does take place from the movie sometimes, you know? Mm-hmm. Because something was exposed. And now somebody is angry about you knowing something. Are you seeing them? Or you probably caught them in the act. For some of y'all, yes, you did. You caught their ass in the... Oh, honey, and honey. This reminds me of Bill Duke's cover. You probably... <laughs> y'all, you probably found out. And they are in regret. Heavy regret that they got exposed. Look, they in balance. Two of Pentacles. Seven of Cups. Yeah, honey, they probably got exposed at work. Child, oh my God. I don't know. Let me get out of this. I want all the couples to stay, the happy couples to stay together. If it's you, baby, you already know this is definitely, definitely, and definitely not you. No. And the other one, if you is you, baby, I'm praying for you. I'm sending love and like, no, I mean, I, I ain't even gonna lie. I'm kind of like mm, looking at you side eyed. I am. I am. But I'm not judging you. I'm just letting this between be between you and God. And I'm taking it as a lesson in the collective. To Lord have mercy. Be thankful that God has me in a different mindset. Than to operate and act this way. To take your marriage seriously. Your vows seriously. Like this is hurting people. Misleading people. Somebody is confused. Confused. And they've been lying the whole time. And somebody is lying about them carrying something of be a deadly carrier of whatever and something's getting ready to end for them so this is just crazy it's like when people are afraid to be honest and up truth and frightful they hide back secrets and they hide lies they're not exposed if they would have upfront and honest with themselves they would move in a whole different way they wouldn't even be exposing themselves to other people so what's going on with this? Why is this wish? This person's sad because they're in their head because they're living a lie. Somebody is living a lie. They like what they like. Okay? But they're in love with... Oh, my God. I don't know. Oh, Lord have mercy. But there's this earth angel, though. This earth angel, though, that they want... They made an offer to or wanted to make an offer to. I don't know. This is for couples, though. So... Somebody want to make an offer to you and go down another path. This could be your, who is this person? Y'all, I want to know. I'm like, somebody you held back from. Well, if you in a couple with them and you invested in somebody else. Okay, so you are in a, and then the person you have with right now is stressed out. Why are they stressed out? 
Because maybe, some, I don't know, child, communication. So your person is stressed out. They're, everybody's stressed out. Lord, have mercy. People want you back. There's a lot of betrayal. People from your past. The Six of Cups, they're bored where they're at. They want to come back and mess up your shit. So this is for the couples. You got people from your past couples that are unhappy with their own life. And they want to come back and shake up your shit. I don't know what the hell this is. You want to reject them anyway. It's not like you wanted them back. I'm not never saying that you wanted them back. You don't. They're in their head because they're in trap. They want forward movement. They got is. Yeah. This is, I mean, it is what it is. This is their karma. Yeah, and they know why, but I don't know why they want to invite involve you, high priestess. Yeah, you're you're running your own business. You're doing your own thing, and some of you are like they. Mm, I feel like you're holding back. You're very careful in examining anything that anybody says, do anybody from the past that backstabbed and betrayed you. You've leveled up. You've wisened up. Okay, you're very strong. Okay, people try to undermine you or, yeah, they try to do some type of, but you're a little magical creature. You know how to co-create and manifest your best life to balance out things when people try to throw one on you. And this is a tower. So you balance out your life in this current relationship. So for some of y'all, it is a current spouse. That's, that's, you know, what I said. And then right now you're in a marriage and you're happy right now. And somebody sees your happiness and they're sad because they couldn't make up their mind of what they wanted to do with themselves. And they want to come in and mess up and disturb your peace. Don't let nobody and they, they don't let nobody disturb your peace. Look at them. They're like, I'm so mad I didn't invest in whoever you are. Okay, and they want to come back in and try to disturb your damn peace. Mm -mm. And mess up and separate you and your spouse so they can get dibs at you. Look at this shit. Gemini couples, that's your reading, baby. Stay awoke. Because you. some of y'all, if y'all couples and y'all go out and celebrate and stuff, you got some couples jealous of your love. You got some couples jealous of you guys because they're not where you're at in your relationship. You know what I mean? So, yeah, they're sad and upset. Every time you come around, they feel, and you know it though. You, oh shit, you know who these people are. You know it. Hold on, I'm going to pick it up. That's fail. <clears throat> High Priestess, you know it. Okay, so you got, yeah. Mm -hmm. And you got people willing to break that up so you don't, you know, remain where you're at happy in your relationship. They want to imbalance you with this justice. So couples, stay well. Keep your business to yourself. Stay tight and close-knitted. Meditate, pray together. Okay, communicate. You know what I mean? And no weapons formed against y'all babies will prosper because Archangel Michael is governing. But, you know, it takes all the energy to line up together so they can continue with that protection. But just know you got people wanting to fuck that up for y'all. Okay? And mm -mm. But anyway, baby, that's the reading for you. I hope this helps you couples stay together, love each other, and sending you lots of love and energy. Bye!